I hit the jackpot. So here, I'm gonna, hold on, let me see if I can show what I found. Look, Justin and I were digging in there. Look, look at all this Hello Kitty stuff I found. Barnes and Noble, it's like they knew we were coming. It's like Star Wars, right in the front. <laughs> I don't even see any Black Series. Oh, they have those. Oh, that's not bad for 30% off. Whoa, it's huge. 60 bucks. That's not bad. And then 30 plus the 40% off, so it'd be, what's 40% off for 60 bucks? Six times four, $24 off. That's not bad. Yeah. I'm kind of considering getting it, because this thing, this is really cool. I've seen people take like photos with it, like outside, like in oh, the desert really? area and stuff. It's really cool. That actually does look really neat. It actually is really intricate. Oh, that's cool. And then they have like rays. Oh, really? Which this one isn't as cool, but it does have like the little junk. Oh. Bag and everything on the side. They're 30% off still, so. That's actually kind of cool. Yeah, I was going to say, like, that one's, those are, like, really detailed for the, for the price. I like the displays a lot. They're doing a really good job. Like, the Boba Fett, I want, kind of want the Yoda. Do they have just the Yoda? Or does he come with R2? Like, Yoda, does he come by himself? Or is he in a set? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. I just really like him. Oh, yeah, it's Yoda and R2. Um, mm. See, I would just want, um, just want him. I do like these displays, though. These are really cool. I like it. I definitely like the Joker. He's, like, very sinister looking. <laughs> Let's see if they have anything interesting or fun. Studio Ghibli stuff. We lost Justin. Oh, there's Justin. <laughs> what do they got for your figures? Two Sailor Moon ones. Ooh, Sailor Moon home. Yeah, see, I stopped collecting these, but I do like the crystal one, though. She actually is really, really pretty. Like, if she was on clearance, which I doubt she'll ever go on clearance, I would get her, but she's 40, which isn't so bad. Because I have the Barnes & Noble card, so 10% off that's not bad, but, mm, she'd have to be on clearance, though. And these are, like, the samurai ones. Oh, I know, I those like are awesome. Actually, that's cool. They have a lot of pops and stuff, too. 30% off. They have the little keychain guys. And what else they got? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Pokemon. Oh, they have the little sushi sets. These guys are so cute. And they can like pop out and stuff, but I like the little like bowls. It's adorable. What? <laughs> what is this guy? It's them in like different outfits. Like him as a sumo wrestler. Like his little thing, like his little thing. And then him as like a sphinx, I guess, or something. I don't, I don't know. They're like, let's just throw random stuff on there. Okay, like, oh, what? Oh, they have so many. Oh, they have the little remints. Oh, I saw this at the other one. I kind of wanted it. It's a really Kuma cafe. Mm, I don't need you. Oh my God, they have the figure arts, like little twin stars. 30, ooh, you can go back on the shelf. You're expensive. <laughs> And then what do we got? Oh, oh, the little hamster ones. Raymond's always so detailed though. Like the only one that I have the whole whole set is like the first series Gudetama one, but that's the only one that I have. Ooh, Gudetama pencil pouch. How much are you? No price, but it's cute. <laughs> and then look, oh, they have the figure arts one. Man, figure arts is just like running with it. He's only 20. That's not so bad. What are those? Oh my God. Okay, you need to. I think I was gonna say you need to rock that. I like these. I haven't seen anybody have these out, but they're very like creepy looking, and that's why I like them. The like little naked man figure. That's weird. <laughs> oh, and these are actually really cute. I've had some of those before too. A whole Toki Doki section they know so well. There's pens and erasers and blind boxes and plushies and this adorable pencil pouch, which every time I'm here, I've seen it and I was like, duh, I want it. Oh, it's so cute. A lot of blind boxes though. I haven't done any of the mermaid, the mermaid unicorn ones, but I don't know. Again, if the stuff's on clearance, I'm more likely to buy it, but a bunch of Minecraft stuff. Giant wall of pops at Think Geek. Every pop. They have some for a dollar less, and some are six bucks, it's not bad, but oh, the Monster High ones are only five dollars, I see it right there. That's actually not that bad, if you guys have ever seen Cleo, but That's I had a, yeah, I was going to say some for five, six bucks, four dollars up there, do you see those? That's Assassin's Creed, that's really nothing I'm interested in. 
It's not bad though. I'm trying to clear stuff out. Oh, I see it lighting up. Not that much though. Maybe the batteries are just low. <laughs> Sorry, I like the music in here. I'm like, oh, I hear Stranger Things music. <laughs> what is that? That's epic looking. $150. Whoa, he does look very epic though. That style fits Black Panther really well, the play arts kind. Because those are always so like anime. Yeah. I like it. That looks really cool. There's also a Groot toaster. <laughs> Just in case you wanted a Groot so toaster. Weird, weird <laughs> Ooh, oh, they have the replicas. Look at them. Oh my god, I love it. It's so pretty. Don't want to spend the $80, but it's I still really pretty. Like retro carded figures that they've been doing recently. Yeah, the Superpower one, Super, Super <laughs> Amigos. Those are cool. This Batman movie. She actually looks really cute. Her finger looks a little weird, but. She but I like the box. Actual, like, bend the knees too. Yeah, this one looks way better than the regular one. What? Oh my god, they made a Chewie in this line? His face looks really good. Actually. Wait, does he talk? Ooh, press his button. Let's hear him. <laughs> oh, okay. I have faith in this line again because that, that won me over with the, with the sound. Oh, I know. I would be so bad, but I can't justify spending thirty dollars on that. That is a lot for that. But they're so cute, though. Oh, I don't want the compact. So, bad. oh my God, giant rain cloud plushie is so cute. Even here has those. Really, that's so weird. I do like these a lot, though. These are really cute keychains. I just saw those come out, but I've seen them cheaper other places, so I'll wait. <laughs> Look at Barb's glasses. Okay, I love these. Like, Funko did a good job on these plushies, in my opinion. Like, they're just so adorable. Oh, I love it. Now we're at GameStop, and I, my love for Harrison Ford, like, these are the Kenner figures that they redid and revamped. He actually looks really, really good. I might have to just buy him. Like, he's so cute. Star Wars clearance. Oh my gosh. Eh, nine dollars, and then those to me like those look really weird. Like I never got into those. Like the weird little legs and like I don't know. I think it's like they're trying to re revive Bionicle. But oh, looks a little strange to me. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't know. really look like him that much. I don't know about that one. Yeah. And they got <laughs> the giant yeah, plushie. Oh wow, that's yeah. really cheap. All right, I'm gonna find some dolls here. I have a feeling, I have this feeling. <laughs> Pixie sticks, cars. That's actually really cute. <laughs> oh, they're all candies. Oh, that's Sweet cute. And Taffy. That's neat. I like that Hot Wheels like does that. like cool stuff like that. Clearance aisle score. <laughs> oh, yeah. These are 250, so I'm gonna get the Malibu Barbie and the original Barbie, and you're getting gummy. Uh, gum, gummy, gummy. <laughs> <laughs> He's so cute. That's actually really, really cheap. cheap yeah. I want to know how much the Rubik's Cube is, because I'd buy that one, too. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. It's, a little, scan it's a little big for, like, Yeah, it's going to be more for, like, scale figures. For me, it would be, like, for an 18-inch doll, not, like, <laughs> for that scale, I guess. Oh, they have Christmas cabbage patches. This is so cute. And look, I like her with her red dress. <laughs> I know I don't need it. I know I don't need it, but it's torturing me. And then, the, oh wow, look, they have that for twenty dollars. What else we got? Good finds. Ooh, ooh. <gasps> that one's my favorite. Like I love him. Poe is always my favorite. Uh, the Teletubbies making a comeback or something? Yeah, they did. They um, had like a couple toys come out this season for it. I wonder is he on clearance? I don't know. I didn't have a sticker. He doesn't. He's probably regular price. I might scan him though, because I really do like him. But Secret Life of Pets is on clearance. This adorable little lamb. Oh, he's so cute. Do you make sounds? Okay, that doesn't sound like a lamb. <laughs> Alright, so we've got bird dolls. What do we have? Uh, trolls. Those are some of those aren't. Oh my gosh! They made it into Target. So if you guys watched the toy. Toy, oh my god, I can't even talk. Toy Fair video. I actually got to meet the ladies that created this, and they were talking about possibly getting into Target. They made it. And this is the one I shot a picture of. So good for them. They did that. Oh, cool. So, yeah, if you guys are interested in those dolls, they have them at Target now. And, ooh, some of the 
DC Superhero Girls are down to $10. Whoa, this is half off. That's a crazy good deal. Like, that's really, really, really good. And the Shibujuku dolls are not clearance, which I saw some people posting. <gasps> oh my gosh, she's so cute. I didn't even know this one came out. Oh, why are you not on clearance? I love the curl pigtails and the overalls. Oh, geez, I'm knocking stuff over. That's so cute. Oh my God. So they did make a bunch of new ones. Oh, you have cat ears. Why aren't you getting out? I want to see what else is behind you. Okay, that's a normal one. Oh my God, she looks like a Spice Girl. That is so cute. All right, maybe I'll scan it anyways, because I know people said that some of them were on clearance. I doubt the new ones are, but oh, I love it. Monster High section is like dead, but look, they have Dracula's little sister for only $2.68, and they have like nothing else here. Like they must have clearanced it out. And I tried scanning that Shibujuku girl, and she's not even in the system. So if I find somebody to figure out a price for me, and hopefully it might be on clearance, because like I said I found people getting them for like 10 bucks, but I have a really feeling that it probably isn't. But yeah, I might get, I don't know, I'm gonna think about that one because that for 268 is a really good deal. But everybody else, I mean, this is pretty wiped out. And I love that the sewing set for Generation Girls is so cute. So for Barbie, there is some stuff on clearance. So we've got these girls are 11 and a handful of the fashionistas, but it looks like all they have is this one outfit for $7. Everybody else seems to be regular price. Barbie and the Rockers is regular price. Um, let's see what we got. Bathroom set. Ooh, the Christmas one finally dropped. That one's 14. Some fashions, which I'm gonna go through for the doll project that I want to do. <laughs> and I don't think I see anything else that's on clearance. Ooh, the President 2 pack is down to 17, which I think I've saw, seen before that I remember. And then on this side we got Disney. And all they have left is Merida. <laughs> Everything else is regular price. Oh, they got these that are 238. Really not that bad of a deal. And Elsa, hmm. All right, so I think I'm just gonna scan through some of the fashion packs and see if I find something on sale. Store number, I don't remember because I lost count, but I will post the numbers at the end of the video. So they have fashionistas for seven bucks, which isn't that great of a deal. And then they have some of the Star Wars Rebel ones. These are only $2.99 if I can't want to focus on them. That's not so bad. But the thing that I was really freaking out about here, let's go over here. Oh my gosh, I love this movie. And it's only $4. He looks a little weird but it's only $4 and it's really cute. And the thing that Justin found at Toys R Us that was $150, $80. So what have we learned? Check your Ross, because <laughs> it's a really, really good deal. Oh, someone decided to just steal Mr. Potato Head, unfortunately. But let me see, do they have any other dolls, 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 dolls? So they had the one Barbie, they have this Barbie, Dreamtopia. Mm -hmm. Baby set, some plushies. What is this? Oh, they have little squinkies. And then <laughs> I didn't like you didn't see like I saw you just randomly standing there and I'm like, what is he doing? <laughs> that thing is epic. A hundred dollars. It's actually not bad. <laughs> oh <laughs> there is two. Oh that's okay. I think we found the screenshot picture that we have to take now because that's really funny. Oh, that's so cool. How much for she? She's pretty. See, I don't really like these that much. Uh, six bucks. Like, she's pretty, but it's like, I can't just... Oh, they have dorbs here, too? Really? Okay, Ross stepping up their game on things. <laughs> Haven't been at a Ross in a while. All the boxes are destroyed on this stuff, though. More... They have a ton of these Barbies with the one fashion pack thing. Oh, this figure. It's so funny. I saw it for 17 at, um... GameStop and it's eight dollars here or nine dollars here, but her eyes though, man, not not so cute. <laughs> now we're in Five Below, and they have some more Star Wars figures everywhere. It's just Star Wars crazy, but they're five bucks, which isn't bad. And then we got random other figures. If you guys don't have the store around you, everything is literally five dollars or less. So sometimes you can find like a good deal, like Rick Flag for five bucks. <laughs> oh wow, they look, they have a. Uh, Wonder Woman back there, some of the DC superhero girls. That's actually not that bad for five bucks. She's cute. It was probably retail at like 10, 10 or 12. Yeah, normally 10 or 12. Yeah, if it was a different character, I might be interested, but yeah, it's kind of cool though.
I hit the jackpot. So here, I'm gonna, hold on, let me see if I can show what I found. Look, Jess and I were digging in there. Look, look at all this Hello Kitty stuff I found. I am very happy right now. So they have a bunch of like fashionistas and other stuff on clearance. They have the holiday Barbie on clearance. They have the new babysitting dolls. So Walmart, this one, especially Waterford, has a lot. So if you're in this area, check it out. So here, let's flip this over. So they have this fashionista. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna pick that up in a second. And <laughs> they have this one for five bucks, which I don't know, her hair looks weird. And that's just like a plain Barbie one. I'm not really feeling any of those. Well, they have Man Bun Ken for five dollars. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> oh, I need him. Because everyone has him except for me. And I just need him because he's so like iconic, I feel like. I'm you know? Off his man bun. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm not looking, he just comes like, doop, gone. Oh, there's so much stuff. All right, so let me, I'm gonna have to find a cart. This this is cart territory right now. Cause look, even in like the My Life stuff's all on sale and Justin's gonna go steal someone's cart. Oh my God, they have Dr. Barbie on sale. They have little fashion stuff. Like we're definitely do, gonna do a haul thing at the end of this because I have so much stuff I'm buying right now. Oh my God, look, this is all on sale. Oh, the look at the yoga mat. Ah. Wow, these are only nine dollars. They like really went cheap on these. Yeah, to the That's cool. Oh look, her one oh. That's only nine dollars too for the. See, I stuff. wonder if I can find one that her eyes look good. Cause some of these are eyes look weird, but I like her though. She's like my favorite character in those movies. And then like, what else they have? Play sets. Oh, these are on sale. The fashions are only six dollars. These are seven, four dollars for those mini ones. Like. A lot of stuff on sale. The Monster High stuff, which is a little bit more money than Target for that. So I was hoping the Spirit Dolls would be on sale because I don't have one and I kind of wanted one. Um, oh, that's only 30 The playset with the dad is a really, really good deal. They're starting to do like scale stuff for the smaller dolls, which that one's only $7. And it looks like little Ikea furniture. It's so cute. And then look at this little chair. That's such a good idea. Look at this chair for the top. I love it, I love it. All right, I'm not gonna buy this cause it's big and I don't have any space for this, but I like it though a lot. And they have all these dolls for 21, but that's all the soccer ones though. They don't have anything else, I'm kind of sad. I really, really like the babysitting dolls. I think they're cute. And I like the boy too. That's really, really adorable. Like I haven't seen a boy in this scale for like Skipper in so long. And I wonder what, does he have a name? I don't know, he's really cute though. I definitely definitely like that a lot. I like, I'm glad they're bringing back the babysitting ones. So now that we made it back after an epic journey of buying tons of stuff, I realized I bought like 99% Barbie stuff, which I didn't even really initially mean to do, but I really wanted all of these Barbie fashionista, or excuse me, the uh, Hello Kitty stuff. So this is everything I got, and most of it was on clearance, except for the Hello Kitty stuff, which obviously is regular price. And then, what'd you get over here? Mm, then he got some Halo stuff that was on clearance, but everything else is, everything else is regular price, right? Mm -hmm. Well, like, I think he got him to price match the, Snorlax thing, but Snorlax, Metroid, which was like forty dollars on Amazon. Which, like, That's so crazy. Now. Yeah, the Toys R Us had it so cheap. Him now, yeah. Hmm. And then the Stormtrooper. Yeah, he's cool for your epic because army. Like five stormtroopers. <laughs> Which I'll post his Instagram right here in the picture if you guys want to follow him. He takes pictures of a lot of his toys and stuff on there too. But yeah, that's everything that we bought. So yay, we had an exciting time doing a toy hunt video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Comment below what's your favorite item that you got. If I had to pick one favorite, I think I'd have to say my Hello Kitty outfits are my favorite thing that I got today because that's really really pretty. <laughs> yeah, I just like that he's squishy. Look at him, he's squishy. <laughs> Thanks for watching, you guys. Bye.